It's very appropriate that the person joining us from Ahmedabad today is the Minister for Health and Family Welfare and also the spokesperson of the government of Gujarat, Jainar and Vyas, because the specific issue, which is uh, our next subject of uh, debate, is a huge controversy. And also, by the way, uh, joining us on that debate is Ami Yagnik of the Gujarat Congress and Janvi Andharia, who is a member of the Ansuraksha Adhikar Abhiyan of Gujarat. She is very critical of the policies of the Narendra Modi government. A, a quick recap uh, uh, to, to our viewers. This entire controversy is about this. And before I go into the news report, this is the, what the controversy is about. There is a photograph in a Gujarat Congress ad which shows a malnourished child in the arms of a woman. This is aimed at talking about how bad the situation is in Gujarat under Narendra Modi. However, the story is actually completely different. Here's the report. This advertisement issued by the Gujarat Congress for the upcoming assembly polls causing a major embarrassment for the party itself. Congress finds itself in a soup over an election ad campaign that depicts a Sri Lankan impoverished baby as part of his campaign to show malnutrition in Gujarat. Now this is the Congress ad original showing the baby in the hands of a mother and if you can go to the original from where it has been picked up, this is the website, a Christian charity website on the Sri Lankan floods called Amien Park Chapel. It has videos of the Sri Lankan floods of February this year and then it goes on to show some pictures. As part of this is the original picture from where it has been picked. Now this shows the baby with the tikka on the forehead and some jewelry on the mother. Now if you go to the Congress ad, the tikka is missing. It's a close-up picture with the jewelry of the mother missing. So cut and paste job done. Congress trying to hide behind the creative ad agency that has done this, but clearly the party would need to explain how it happened. Interestingly, this has come out as part of BJP sympathizers trolling the net in support of Narendra Modi. So a campaign which is totally based on lies, which is totally divorced from truth, cannot cut much ice with people of Gujarat or rest of the country. They are denigrating and defaming Gujarat. Gujarat voters will never forgive those who defame Gujarat and that is why they will punish Congress. The BJP making full use of the big Congress goof up, sending the Congress into a tizzy. आगर कई रीते चालू ऐनी चिंता करवाने बदले आ भारतीय जनता पक्ष ना आगे वानो शुरुलक बाबतो उभरी करी। I mean if some ad agency has brought in a photograph that is wrong, I think it's regrettable, but that's not the issue. The issue is really whether what the Congress has raised and what is trying to portray through an image is that important or not. Not just this time, the Gujarat Congress had scored another own goal in last January, praising Modi in one of its ad campaigns. But this time, with the assembly elections round the corner, this major howler has surely put the Congress in the back foot once again. Especially since it is facing major rebellion from its own workers over ticket distribution. With Abhishek in Ahmedabad, Fiona Pujara for Times Now. Let's get short introductory comments first. First from Ami Yagnik. Isn't it regrettable, Ms. Yagnik, that it's now come down to this, that the Congress party has to use pictures of malnourished children from Sri Lanka, Photoshop those pictures, morph those pictures and put them in the context of a Gujarat ad. I mean, is, if this is not lies, then what is? This cannot just be a mistake. This must be deliberate. No, Ar no Arnav, it is not a mistake. If you see the ad, it is just a reference photo. It is where is it written that it's a reference uh, photo? Types of stock. No, where is it stock, written that it's a reference images. photo? First, tell me where have you written it's a reference no, it, photo? It, it, where it is the is disclosure? Just, it's just an image. It's no. just a reference image from stock images, and just to show that this is the malnutrition. Have in you read? Gujarat. Have you but said? That cannot be. Have yes, you said? I have, I have read that. Have you no? Have you written anywhere have representative read, picture? Have you written somewhere this picture is not from Gujarat? Did you write it anywhere is not in your ad written, campaign? It is, from, it is not from Gujarat, it is not from here, it is not from there. No. It is just a stock image just to show. No, why? Where? What is stock image? Would be like no, what this. do you mean by stock and image? We have shown facts. 
What do you mean so by we stock images? We generally take stock images as far as because it has to be subtle to show that these are malnourished. Where is the subtlety in it? You a child, a, a child, a child in that condition in the hands of his mother, in the, a child in that condition in the hands of his or her mother. You are saying that these are stock images, no. representational pictures. I won't like to put the pictures up. I get a reaction can, from Jaina and Vyas. From Jaina and Vyas, first so reaction, you please. You can find this out from the Google record. Yes. And the real pictures are so horrifying. You are taking Arnav a picture of a so victim of a flood. You are taking a picture of a victim of a flood and that to a child from a website of an organization. Or, and you're picking it up and you're saying this is the situation of children in Gujarat. I don't know the honesty in that. Jaina and Vyas, your reaction. I'll put the picture up right now. Let's put it up on the screen. Yes, Mr. Vyas. Adna, <coughs> Congress is dazed. The kind of rebellion that they have been facing in last few days have totally shaken them. And look at this argument. It is naive to say that you pick up a stock image on the contra, if I may interpret it other way around, that means that you don't get realistic images in Gujarat and what claims you are making with reference to the text, you don't get relevant pictures and therefore you are picking it up from anywhere it is available. I think better pictures would have been available <laughs> from we other parts of the world the to, which are under children like Namibia or Angola. I'd like to get in uh, Janvi Andharia no, at this we stage. May not go so far. I'd like to get in Janvi Andharia. Let's get a third perspective yeah. tonight. Janvi, the minister yes. says the minister says you take up a picture because there aren't these conditions of malnourished children in Gujarat. The Congress party is searching for these pictures on the internet and misrepresenting them in their ad campaign. Your response to the minister? Yeah. Yeah, I, uh, Arnav, I think that, you know, the let's not get technical into this whole thing about where the photograph is and what the thing is. But I think if we go by the data, which is the NFHS, National Family Health Survey 2005-6, which is standard data, says that in Gujarat, we have underweight uh, children at the rate of 44.6%, which is ah. a measure of weight You've by age. You've come armed with the pictures, Even yes. more is stunting. Stunting is 51.7%, which is height for age, and this any nutritionist will tell you is a symbol of chronic. Miss Andaria, Miss Andaria, so if, I your, if I take your if I take your point for it, take your point for it, I take your point for I know what you're talking about, but that if those figures are real, then why don't you put the pictures out? Where is the desperation? I'm simply asking you, Ami Agnik, why yeah, don't you tell why, why the desperation? No, put the, 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 the real picture with the real fact. Don't put the don't put the don't put the correct facts with the wrong picture. Because people will accuse you of sheer really? and open misrepresentation. I'm not contesting your facts. I know 44% of children below the age of 5 yeah. suffer from malnutrition. 70% yeah. of children in the state suffer from anemia. But then why are you using these wrong okay. pictures? So, no, first, well, will you so apologize for the use of a wrong picture? Image, why don't we this add is the just time? A stock image. If we put the real pictures, it you will are be using the sentiments of Gujarat. We are the government has already done injustice to these people <laughs> by eating <laughs> away into their nutrition factor. Adnab, 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 one, lie, children, one more lie cannot children, cover up the lie that has already around. been spoken. You you have already tried because you know that this ad has become a hit. People have identified that yes, this is the situation of malnourished children in Gujarat. You have become panicky and now trying to. You don't you don't think today, Ami Agnik, that your entire campaign has your entire campaign has boomeranged on you? No, no, one second, Ami Agnik, you don't think your entire campaign has boomeranged on you? No, not at all. In fact. People are thinking that this ad, you know, they're identifying with the ad that, ad that there is so much malnourishment. Midday meals are also being eaten away by the government. And so the government has become panicked. Don't show me the figures. I let me. No, reply on the picture. Image. 